couple weeks ago I ordered these lights. They're just it's a little strip LED lights. It costs like a dollar and a dollar shipping. Comes straight off the boat from China, you know. And I was, I'm going to hook them up inside my topper. So when we're camping, and I got my boats and stuff back here, I can I don't have to use a flashlight or nothing. I can just flick a switch. I'll just be able to flick a switch, and I'll have lights down the middle. And I was having a heck of a time finding a place to light them. Well, I figured, well, I'll go with the seven-way. You know, I'll, I'll pick off the power from the seven-way and then run up. But I got the uh, multimeters out, and I'm finding that I only have seven volts back there on the on the on the pin. You're supposed to have uh, from the let's see from the positive there to the negative. You're supposed to have 12 volts. I was only getting seven volts. Well, I took it apart, took it, unplugged it. And the uh, the negative was all corroded. It was all green, completely green. So what I did is I took some sandpaper and I wrapped it around a, a thin piece of wood and I sanded them off. But then, how the heck am I going to get the corrosion out in there, in this one right here? So I thought to myself, self. Let's use a feeler gauge with sandpaper wrapped around it. And uh, that worked out pretty good. Let's see if I can see if I can actually show you. This is gonna be hard to do with one hand, I think. There we go. There and then just uh Take that. Move that in and about. Clean the inside of that. I'll clean it a little better and then I'm going to spray it down with some LPS No Flash contact cleaner and we should be good to go. And then I'll, I'll, I'll pick the wire off the back and I'll I'll run my wires, run my lights. All right, spritzed her down and look how clean that is now. Yeah, I should be getting 12 volts at the plug. There's the stick of wood I've used. It's an eighth inch piece and it's this uh, sticky back sandpaper. It doesn't like to stick to that side very well though. But uh, yeah, what I did was took and just used it like a file or if you have a file or whatever you can do that. But now I'm going to clean up the insides. Those inside connections too. I'm going to just sand them up a little bit. And uh, then it should be good. Alrighty, I'm running the wires. I ran it down and I, uh, I picked the power from there. And I'm running it up. And the lights will get stuck. Where'd one of the lights go? Here's one of the lights. The lights will get stuck on this. There's where the switch will go. And it'll go right here. And you flip on the switch, you light shine in that direction. So. Well, there we have it. It's all wired up. Neat, huh? <laughs> well, anyway, the only problem is I got, uh, might hit that switch loading in stuff, but. Oh well. I think it'll work. If it's dark out, it'll definitely be better than dark. So. Thanks for watching.
I thought I'd show you what they look like in the dark. Ooh, it's dark out. It's dark out. Camera doesn't know what to focus on. how much it lightens it up in here. Bye.